Hi everybody, welcome to this video. You know two things if you watch my videos. One, I love to entertain, and two, I'm a Pampered Chef consultant. So whenever I'm gonna entertain, whether it's in my home or we're gonna make some dishes and take them to a friend's house, you know I'm always gonna use Pampered Chef products. In this video, I'm gonna share five of those products with you. Three are going to be actual entertainment wear, the ones I serve the dishes in, and then two are gonna be the actual products I use that help me be more efficient and make these dishes even easier. So let's get into it and let me show you what those are. The first item I wanna share with you is the chip and dip set. It is made of the stoneware, but what is so great about this is it has an enameled finish which means you can go ahead and heat it and serve it without dirtying another dish. This bowl is removable. All of this is microwavable. Either item you can put in the microwave. It's also freezer safe and the bonus, dishwasher safe. So it's amazing that you can heat this up to 450 degrees and then serve it right from this tray. Let me share some of the dishes I have made with this. These include pigs in a blanket or any kind of variation like these pretzel bites or I've done sausage roll-ups, which are always a hit and one of the first appetizers to disappear. I also love putting brie on the center and then putting my baguette slices all around. You could put this in the oven and the brie will melt while the baguette toasts and then you could serve it directly from this chip and dip tray. Love it. Another thing I've made and served from this dip and chip set is this California chicken club ring with avocado spread. This is so delicious. I have the recipe of how I made this at the very end. So this I'm using pretty much every single time I have a party. Next up, let's talk about the stoneware entertaining platters. This is the medium size and I also have the large, which I'll show you as well. I use this every single time I entertain. I also use this when I'm bringing food to a friend's house because it retains heat so well. So I can go ahead and have the item cook it at my home or cook it at their home if their oven is available. And I can have it just kind of covered with aluminum foil, bring it to the party and this retains heat that even when I get to the party, the food is usually still warm. But sometimes I might make it in something else and just serve it on here, even if it's a cold appetizer. I just love how pretty, how elegant, and sophisticated this looks. And so I might just put a dip and some crostinis around just to serve it in this beautiful serving platter. Let me show you the larger size. You can see the size comparison between the medium and the large. And no matter what I'm serving, hot or cold, I use them. They're dishwasher safe as well. They're perfect for cooking and then serving straight from the platter. Love these so much. The next item I'm gonna share with you is something I've shown in previous videos, but I wanna highlight this because we're getting into grill season and these are the perfect things to throw on the grill. These are of course your mini cast iron skillets. They fit in the palm of my hand, they come in a set of two, and they are perfect for desserts and appetizers. When I use them the most, it's usually for brie. I have whipped up a couple brie appetizers and let it cook on the grill. And then it retains that heat and I have put it on my serving platter. So that way the heat stays, it's okay to put something this hot that's been on the grill onto my serving platter and then I serve the cracker or the bread or whatever I am making to serve with my brie, it can go on that platter and I can just put this on there. So it's perfect if you're gonna go to someone's house, brie is the easiest appetizer. It's so versatile, you can make it savory, you can make it sweet, you can make it spicy. Brie is the perfect neutral cheese that can go with just about anything. So I usually make a brie when I am having a party. And putting it on here, let's say you are going to a friend's house, you can easily find space in their oven or just on top of their stove. And if you're having a cookout barbecue, you can just put this on a little part of their grill if you need to finish the cooking when you get there. I love these things. They're perfect for chocolate chip cookies if you wanna make that on the grill s'mores dip. I have done just about everything on these and I will continue to do so as we continue going through the summer and the grilling season. 
Another Pampered Chef item I find crucial for entertaining are these one cup and two cup. They also have them in three cup. They are your prep bowls. And what's so great about these, they come with lids. They also have the little notch on the side that tells you the measurement. So you know that you have your half cup, your one cup, your one and a half to two cups. So that is perfect. That way, liquids, onions, chopped, whatever you have, your vegetables diced, you can see that easily right here and then cover it with a lid. Also, it's perfect for dump and go. I mean, they call it a prep bowl and that's exactly what I think of with mise en place. So you could put everything in its place and then have it all ready for you in the fridge. It's so nice to just have it and don't think about it because I have found when I try to be portioning things out, measuring things during or right before a party, I usually mess up. <laughs> I, do. I usually do that teaspoon versus the tablespoon or worse, the tablespoon and can't take it back and it was a teaspoon. I am doing those things because I'm in hurry rush mode and also my eyesight's not as good as it used to be. So looking at the measurements of things gets a little harder. That's why it's great to do this. You can also do this in advance and that's where entertaining, you need all the things and all the tools you can have to do things in advance. Prep bowls. I think they're probably one of my favorites when it comes to entertaining. The next item I want to share with you that I use all the time, especially when entertaining, is my manual chopper. You have seen me use this in previous videos whenever I am chopping up nuts, say pistachios or almonds, because a lot of times when you cut nuts, they tend to fly everywhere. This at least keeps it contained. And when you push the little handle down, all of your nuts stay together. They're not flying all over the counter. So I really love that. The other thing I use this for that is a life changer is onions. Onions, no matter how fast I chop, I'm always crying. But if I get this, I am reducing the amount of tears I am shedding when it comes to chopping up onions, especially when you're making like a bunch of appetizers that call for onions and garlic. It is so nice to do this in a batch, right? You're just getting all your onions and all your garlic minced and chopped all ahead of time. It is perfect. And you know, once you have those onions and that garlic all minced and chopped, you put it in those prep bowls. Perfect combination. I love using this for those items specifically because chopping an onion and chopping garlic, even though you could use your mincer doing this with all those cloves, let's say you could put quite a few cloves under here at a time, chop, chop, chop away, and then put it in your prep bowl until you're ready to use it for appetizers. Those are two ingredients I tend to use quite often, especially garlic. So this is perfect. And the parts are removable and dishwasher safe. So you can go ahead and put all the parts into the dishwasher and make it super easy. Love this. Okay, so those are the five Pamper Chef products that I wanted to share with you that are perfect for entertaining. Of course, Pamper Chef has so many products, ones that I think are awesome. I only wanted to highlight five today to make this video not so long and to really focus on the ones I use really much every single time. So those are the five favorites for entertaining. As mentioned, here's that recipe for the California Chicken Club Ring with avocado dip. In my classic batter bowl, I have four cups of fresh kale along with a tablespoon of minced garlic and a package of crisp bacon that I've cooked in my air fryer. I microwaved all that in the microwave for two minutes and now I'm adding chopped tomatoes and one cup of white cheddar cheese or you could use Colby Jack or actually any cheese you prefer. And then I have the chicken from a rotisserie chicken and I am adding that. It's about one pound shredded into my classic batter bowl as well. A tablespoon of mayonnaise as well as Dijon mustard are both added to the mixture. I have put a package of crescent rolls with the points facing out and put them all around. I have my medium sized scoop and I'm just going to go ahead and scoop this all around. Fold this over. Before going in the oven, I'm going to brush it with some egg whites. And now it's ready to go into our 375 degree oven for 25 to 30 minutes. Our avocado dip is one half cup of Greek yogurt, one large avocado, 
I'll have a teaspoon of lemon juice, one green onion, and a little bit of salt. And now I'll put my lid on. We're just gonna use our manual food processor just to blend this together. Look at our beautiful ring, how golden brown it is. Perfect. Is our green dip, which is perfect because the colors are so nice together. Look at that. This ring is perfect for entertaining or for just serving the family for dinner. Thank you so much for watching, especially to the end. I'll see you on the next video.